Morning folks, it's me. I'm out in the park this morning, um, just putting the signs out, as you can see. I just thought I'd share with you um, what it's like at the minute underfoot. It's, it's raining today, but it's not too bad. You'll see down here, the grass is quite wet. And along the road, it's all right, but we've got puddles either side. So you're gonna get wet feet if it stays like this. But, to be honest with you, it's not too bad, and I'm probably running worse. So uh, anything else that comes up, I'm going to show you in the course of the, the route today. But um, it's going to get drier over the week, so it's not going to be this bad next week. All right, see you later. If you can see there, just along from where I was just a minute ago, um, we've got a puddle that's going across the road. I'm not sure how deep it is. I'll have a little look. It's a bit splashy, but really not too bad so it should be all right i can't see there being any major problems i say it's going to get drier as we go on it's a fun little bit here i've just come back into the park coming up from about mile a kilometer two two and a half we come through the gate back into the park there's a lovely puddle here super but it's not the entire width of the road so again if you're running in wellies you'll be great but if you're not you can go up the dry bit again it's fine and it's getting drier Oh, now this is fun. This roundabout's a good fun one. On the roundabout, the surface of the roundabout is water. It's a big, thick puddle, and I've seen a few cars going through and having a merry old splash. But we've got a footpath alongside it, which is nice and raised, and is going to be nice and dry. So again, we're fine. We've got no problems. I'm happy with this. Anyone fancy a game of golf? That could be fun. I'm on the golf course just now. And... Behind me, it's a bit damp, and it's rather damp there, but our road runs through it. So again, not a problem for us, it's all good still. It's a rather better view of uh, what has now become a small water feature. And um, very, very keen to see, very, very happy to see the seagulls there using that. Obviously it's a slight incursion of the sea onto onto what was previously dry land, but it's it's all good. Makes it all a bit fun. Gives us a little bit of variety with what we're looking at this year. But again, look, no problem with the road. Yeah, you see, here's a surprise bit. We've just come off the golf course, running up the track, onto the bit where you turn right. And the past few years that's been muddy, and it's been runnable but muddy and a bit mucky, and uh, ended up with some muddy legs and the odd person falling over here and there. Actually, what they've done to it, apart from this puddle here, which we'll have to live with, is they've put down a sort of gravel, not gravel, but sort of relatively hard stony surface. So it's not tarmac, but it's certainly a better surface than it's been before and it's actually probably a nice runnable part of the course. And we can follow that up and then eventually that will take us onto the grass bank and I'm going to have a look at that next. Right, I'm at the hurdle, the horse hurdle, uh, onto the turn for the grass bank. So the bit of road here is fine. And then we can do the turn. Again, a bit of a puddle, but we can get around that okay. Through the uh, anti-motorbike gate and onto the grass. And you can see actually that at the minute the grass isn't too bad. Obviously, there's not been 200 people or 100 odd people each day running along it. So come the end of play on Saturday, it might be a bit more spongy, a bit more squelchy, but for the time being, I'm more than happy with this. If I see anything else, I'll let you know. Oh, I just missed them. Swans were just going over the, uh, over the road. 
turning around now, I'm just outside uh, the reception reception building. Um, and it's alright here, we've come up the pavement, avoiding the cars, and we get to the point where we cross the road. And at the road crossing point, it's just a little bit damp, but you'll see the cars are going through. It's a bit of a puddle. Um, it could be a little bit sloshy there, but you'll know about it. And uh, if they cry out eventually, I'm pretty certain. But it's possible, so there's nothing to worry about. Just to show you with a little bit more detail, the bus stop is there. The bus stop, I wouldn't want to stand in, to be honest with you, waiting for a bus. There's the junction. But you do your left turn, you can go slight, take it slightly wide, and you'll be fine. It's passable there. It's not too bad. And as I say, it's going to dry up over the week, so it's going to be fine. And then once you got past that little corner, it's all dry again. I'm just at the corner, um, after five kilometres, between five and six, just coming up to the, the final sort of burst along the pavement. And obviously this road is, is open, and it's going to be open next week. Um, it's quiet, there's not that many people up. There's quite a lot of people leaving the park today. But, um, along the gully, there are one or two spots where um, the water's gathering in the gullies. So, cars as they're going alongside the pavement, pavement side towards into the park, like this one here, um, are sort of spraying up. Now, obviously, they're going to know you're there, they're going to see you there, and hopefully they're not going to drive straight through it and soak you. But, that's a possibility just to obviously make you aware. If the weather's like it is today, which is grey, raining, but not raining hard, it's not throwing it down, then you're gonna have a coat on, you're gonna have waterproofs on anyway, so it'll be fine. Um, I'm saying a lot of it will be fine because I'm quite confident that everything is gonna be fine and I've got no, no worries that this is the worst it's gonna be this week. It's gonna get better as we go on, it's gonna get drier, and it's gonna be a fantastic weekend. I'm really looking forward to it. Um, if there's anything else that crops up between here in the last sort of 700 metres between or 500 metres between here and the uh, the start line again I'll let you know but I suspect it probably won't but there's a there's a puddle and if there were a car coming past here I'm pretty certain that 80% of them might drive straight through it and get me wet because they're nice like that right anything else I'll let you know I'm just down from the start finish area here um, not the start finish area, no, the race village, the race village area where the finish line is. Uh, and obviously, just to let you know, that just behind me, that's a bit of a water splash. It's nothing too exciting, nothing too extravagant, but it goes the width of the road and it's about an inch and a half, two inches deep at worst. So, um, perfectly runnable, nothing to worry about. It'll be, uh, it'll be lovely actually. And again, I'm, I've said a few times, we're clearing it's drying up. It'll be lovely at the weekend. Promise.